Hello, Cynthia here. This video is going to show you how you can register for alumni services with the ATSU Library and Lonesome Doc. You need to begin in the ATSU portal, my.atsu.edu, and log in. If you don't already have a login, you can get it here at www.atsu.edu slash alumni portal, fill out that short form, and then you'll get your ATSU login. Once you're logged into the ATSU portal, you can find the link to the Alumni Library webpage under the Departments menu. And the first option is Alumni. I select Alumni Library. It goes to the Library webpage. The Alumni Library webpage looks like this. So you can see there's links to information resources on the left, and this second heading talks about the journal articles. You can get three journal articles a month for free. If you want more than three per month, it's $10 each. In order to use this service, uh, you need to register first with us and then with Lonesome Doc. So if you click here, there's a short form to fill out. email address because I already have and I'm registered. So you fill out that form, the asterisk fields are required, submit that form, and very important here is this authorization code. So I'm just going to copy this here. So you're, that registers you with the school, gives you access to the authorization code, and after you, have, after you have the authorization code you can register at Lonesome Docs. So you click on this link. go ahead and get started. You need to uncheck this link uh, because we're not listed with the public even though we are available to the public. So I'm going to search for the libraries in Arizona. ATSU is the third option here. Click on that contact in order to select it. Here's where you type in the authorization code. You are affiliated, so I'm going to continue. So here's some information on Lonesome Doc. It's basically a service that you makes it very easy to request articles through PubMed. So go ahead and fill out this information. You know, you're almost finished. Fill out this form, click continue, and then the last step, it'll ask you to verify. So once you've filled out all that information, you can easily request articles through PubMed. So let me just show you uh, from the link from the alumni webpage, go to PubMed. So as an alumni, I'm, I'm recording this on campus, so I'm going to get the full text links, but you won't have the access to the same journal articles that you did when you were a student. So you put your search in, find an article that looks interesting. I want one that's not free so I can show you. So this is something as a student you could access. So in order to order it through Lonesome Doc, click on the Send To, click on Order, and once you click on this, it'll ask you for your Lonesome Doc login. So you can easily request articles through PubMed after you've registered with Lonesome Doc. If you have any questions, you can call the libraries. The phone number's here, 660-626-2345 for the library in Kirksville. And for the Arizona Library, it's 480-219-6090. Thank you.